Hey guys, how's it going? Uh, it's my day off and I'm just getting ready to head outside. It's insanely windy and cold today. I just got a call from the people at the town hall and they told me that they have something really special for me there and I'm really excited to go pick it up. <笑>うん。あ、鹿うん。ほほ。ほほ。ほほ。ほほ。ほほ。ほほ。ほほ。ほほ。ほほ。ほほ。ほほ。ほほ。ほほ。ほほ。ほほ。ほほ。ほほ
but yeah, their spice variety is a little bit lacking, which is disappointing, but whatever. Ugh, what should I use for tomato sauce? If I didn't know this was Japan, I would think that this is just like a regular American house. This is like the whitest house ever. This house looks empty. There's a lot of empty old houses here in Iowa, which is why I was able to rent one. <laughs> Tadaima! Tadaima! Hi! Hi, babies! All right, here we go. This is wild boar. It's very, very interesting, very fresh. I thought this would be like a fat cap, but it's like actually the skin. And if you look really closely on the skin, there's still like little baby hairs attached to it. So I think I'm probably gonna cut that off. Um, I'm going to give it a rinse, cut it up, and uh, start cooking it. All right, I did a lot of research before making this one. After cleaning up the cuts of boar, I seasoned them with salt and pepper, and then lightly seared them over the stove. Next, I fried some celery and onion in the oil left behind from the boar meat. Then, I used white wine to deglaze the pot. And then I added a can of diced tomatoes, and seasoned it with oregano, bay leaves, salt, and pepper. Next, I set my slow cooker on high for about 4 hours, and when it was all done, I topped it off with a mixture of chopped parsley, garlic, and lemon peel. As always, the recipe will be in the description if you want to try it yourself. My other camera died while filming, so I have to shoot with the Lumix, but oh my god, this is really good. The meat is pretty much falling apart. Very nice. This is a good stew. I'm really, really proud of myself. I didn't think it was going to turn out this well and I was expecting like a weirder taste. Good job, me.